Hi guys, it's Leaky here and welcome to another video. If you're new here, my name is Leaky and I review a lot of active fur. So if you're into that kind of stuff, you should just keep watching. Although of course today from the title you might have guessed uh, I'm doing some swim wear as well. I mean swimwear is also kind of active wear, so again if you're interested, you know, keep watching. Um, and I thought it would be interesting, I've, I've recently reviewed a lot of like swimwear from different brands and stuff. Um, I will just link the playlist here for you so you can check that out. And I thought it would be nice to kind of just stay, like, kind of do a video where I show you maybe my top five uh, sets that I'd be reaching for. Because <clears throat> I have so many um, now after reviewing all of this stuff. Like, um, it would be good to kind of just see what I gravitate towards. Because, uh, I mean, you know, there's there's a few pieces that I know for sure are in my closet and that I really like. And that I, usually if I have to quickly pack my bag for going swimming, then these are the ones that I'm grabbing because I'm 100% sure I like these, I feel comfortable in them, and they're amazing. Of course, that doesn't mean that I don't like any of the other pieces that I got, it's just like these are more of my go-tos, if that makes sense. And uh, I thought we could go through them today. Uh, so you can also, in case you're still looking for some swimwear for the summer, um, you can check those out and you can you can get them or you can, uh, you know, just see um, what my favorites are, yes. Uh, there's no ranking to these or anything. I just like, you know, try to think about like if I had to pick like five sets, which ones would they be? And uh, this is what I'm going to show you. So, like I said, we'll talk about them in sets today. I also have some one pieces in there, but let's talk in sets. So even though we have two pieces, we will regard this as a set. So first off, um, this is also for the people that like to suntan. It's not really my thing, because uh, I just get too bored very fast. <laughs> I don't know, I just can't sit still. Uh, but we have the Buff Bunny uh, Sunkissed set. So we have the Sunkissed bikini bottoms here um, that are very, like, cheeky and very adjustable as well, because we have the straps on the side, and you can even adjust here um, at the kind of, like, this, this waist thing. You can make this a little bit smaller or bigger. And um, some some light gold details here at the ends just don't don't hit yourself with this because this hurts <laughs> and uh, yeah very adjustable you can wear them however you want like lower on your hips higher on your hips and again like i said very um, minimal coverage but it's great for tanning or if you like me just have like i don't know smaller waist and wider hips and i feel like it just looks really flattering and this is a very very pretty color this is called lavender i believe and they had this set, so this bot these bottoms in like a lot of different colors. Uh, I'm not sure what's currently available, but like they did restock uh, after their initial swim launch, and you know there's still a lot of pieces in stock, so you can check that out and see if you like it. It's a definitely higher quality triangle bikini bottom, because um, if you're like, oh, why do I need this? Because it just looks like a basic triangle bikini bottom. But this one does feel a little bit higher quality than some others that I've tried. Um, also how it fits, it fits a little bit more secure and stuff. And to go with this, we have the Sunkissed Bikini Top, which is also strappy and, oh dear. <laughs> and also, again, a little bit different in terms of a triangle bikini top. So in, if you're wondering here again why you should get this, and it does have, it, it's, it's slightly different. Um, it's a little more structured, I feel like in the top, you can still kind of adjust here at the bottom. We have removable cup pads in this, which I really appreciate. And then in the back, like a super like cute knitted, knitted, knotted detailing here. And then like you have very long straps. So you can kind of wrap them around yourself. You can like kind of decide yourself a little bit how this, how this fits in a way. And you still have a lot of adjustability with this. Um, so it's, it's great. It's basically like the bottom that you can have like adjusted to fit your body and your, your chest size and whatnot. And I think this detailing here in the back is just like really cute, the, the knots here. And um, a little bit different than your normal triangle bikini top for sure. So yeah, like I said, I like this because it's like, I feel like this is very flattering also on smaller chests. And like I said, this is very flattering for like if you have a smaller waist and a bigger hip butt area. Um, so let's see these on, these two pieces. All right, here we have the sun kiss set. Um, yeah, very, very minimal coverage from both of the pieces. So great for tanning if that's your thing, or also just if you like this. And I will say, I think this is very flattering um, for the smaller waist and the bigger hips. 
for sure. Um, I like to wear it like this, but you can also wear it a little bit lower on your hips if this is your thing. I personally think it's more flattering to wear it like that, but I mean, to each their own. And of course, it depends on your body type as well. So you have a lot of adjustability here and here, as I already mentioned as well. And of course, if you prefer even less coverage here, you could also theoretically size down because you can always adjust by using these, right? So you could try to have less fabric coverage here and then still make it like fit your waist or your hips. And of course, we do have very high leg, uh, a very high leg situation here because you only have the strings. And then the back, very, very, very minimal coverage. Um, I mean, yes, I can still adjust this slightly, but it's not gonna help with like, you know, my butt eating whatever little bit of fabric is there. Um, but that's all good because this is a very cheeky bottom, you know? And um, some people love this, some people don't, and that's fine. And you can definitely like pair this top with something else if you like this top because you don't have to wear it, buy this as a set, right? Uh, I still think it like works nicely together. Um, and yeah, I do like these bottoms. They feel very secure. I don't feel like any moment this is gonna like fall off, reveal things, whatever. So um, it definitely feels a little bit more high quality than some other triangle bottoms I've tried. Cause sometimes they're a little flimsy and then and a wrong move and you might just expose things up here or on the sides, you know? Um, this It doesn't feel like this is gonna happen with this. So all's good. And of course it's not super high waisted so you're not getting any lower tummy control here. But, you know, it's high enough to not expose everything down there. Yeah. Then we have the Sunkist Bikini Top. Again, nicely adjustable here with, you can adjust a little bit like how wide you want these things to be, how far apart you want them to be. So really dependent on how you want to wear it. And then, like I said, the string is quite long. So I've only wrapped it around once, but you can definitely wrap it around a few more times if you wanted to end in the bag. Um, I wouldn't just put it back and then tie it there because that's too long, but like you can put it back front and then come back again or something. Um, yeah, I think the front looks very simple, but yeah, you have this whole like long string situation. And then in the back, as I also mentioned before, we have this cute like little detailing here with the knots and I think it's like super cute. It's a little bit different and I really like it. And of course also this, um, more like periwinkle color, the lavender is also really, really cute. Also works with my lighter skin tone and I still think it would be flattering on other people as well. Um, yeah, but all in all, I really like this, even though it's like less coverage, I, it's, I still feel confident. It makes me feel good about myself and yeah, it's just flattering on those curves. Next up, we have another Buff Bunny set. We have the Santorini bikini top and the Santorini bikini bottoms. I have this in the terracotta color, but also in the lavender bossy print. So the previous set I showed you was in lavender, and now this is lavender bossy print. What I will say with the prints on the inside, we do have just um, the solid color. So if like kind of it folds over a little bit, it's going to be a little bit more visible. So just keep that in mind. But otherwise, I think it's it's a very cute print and a very nice color, but I also love the terracotta. I think this looks flattering on every skin tone, even when you're like as pale as me. <laughs> After even still, like this is already me being a little tanned, okay? Um, the bottoms are like super nice and high-waisted. They have um, a seam up top here. And we do have also again, like a bit of adjustability because we have this open, like kind of corsetti thing and you can kind of tie this however it fits you best. Um, and yeah, very nice and high-waisted. And then in the back, we have a little bit more coverage, I think. They're still, it's still a little cheeky. I mean, for sure, it's a little bit more coverage than the Sunkist Bikini Bottoms. I don't think you can get less coverage than that. Um, but yeah, it's a little cheeky still. But So you can show off a little bit of your butt, but you can also, you know, hide that lower tummy area that a lot of us are kind of insecure about. And you can still feel very confident and tucked in. And like with this, it's still like a little sexy as well here in the front. So I really like that. And then in the back, you just have this uh, Buff Bunny uh, logo coin here. So yeah, these are the bottoms. Um, here they are also in the Lavender Bossy print. So very cute. And then the top is very, very adjustable and versatile because you can tie it whichever way you want. So you have removable cup hats in here. You have some more solid like 
strappy situation here. So you could kind of wear it like this. And then you have the very long straps here as well. But there's so many possibilities for wearing this. I will see uh, if I can include a video for that as well. You can also wear it like this. And there's so many different op opportun opportunities, possibilities. Um, so yeah, my favorite way, I will of course show you when I have it on. And of course, depending on what your chest size is, you might prefer a different way of wearing it, which is also, I think it's so amazing, this top, um, because you can just adjust it to fit you, to make your chest size look really good, to like keep yourself tucked in. And um, yeah, so this is the Santorini set. And um, let's see it on. All right, here's the Santorini set. This is my favorite way of wearing this bikini top, I think. Um, it flatters my small chest as well, it makes me feel tucked in. And uh, we have the thicker straps here now. So basically I put this on a little awkwardly. <laughs> you had to tie this before and then you kind of put it over here, but you know, not there. And it's, it's a, it takes a little bit of like, um, a little bit of time to kind of figure some of the styles out that you can do with it. But I like this one a lot. Um, yeah, I'm also, because I did it this way, I have like the thicker straps underneath my chest, which kind of gives me a nice amount of support. Like it's not too much jiggling or anything. I'm also not afraid of falling out. I will say though, you kind of have to adjust the cup pads a little bit. I haven't done it perfectly yet. And yeah, that just takes a little bit of figuring out and then it's fine. But yeah, basically I cross the thicker straps here and then tie them in the back here. And the thin ones are just up top. Um, I think I tied it a little tight this one a little bit too tight um, but that's fine I can solve that later um, but yeah so many different opportunities possibilities um, with this one which is really amazing just make sure that you're aware like if you were the lavender bossy print one of course with some of these styles like they're gonna fold over a little bit and you're gonna see the inside and then you will kind of see that the bossy print is not the entire thing that on the inside we do have a solid color so just be aware it's not going to happen with the terracotta one because the color is the exact same on the inside but yeah with a bossy print like depending on how well you fold it you know you might see it a little bit um but yeah i like this particular way of wearing it just because it gives me great support i like it um you can still adjust it a little bit here and there and um i just love that there's so many opportunities no not opportunities possibilities is the word <laughs> So many different possibilities and there's going to be something that fits you perfectly and yeah for small chests i like this one a lot um going on to the bottoms i think they're like so flattering like for that waist you know and also for the hips here a little bit you don't have that like super high leg cut which i find very flattering as well but you do have the um, cutouts here which i kind of like give you a smaller waist i think personally you have a lot of coverage here in the front so not too much showing off here. My belly button is also down there. And for me, it's not super tight up here, so I do have a little bit of space. Um, maybe a little bit of compression here. And then in the back, you still have it a little bit cheeky. So your cheeks are kind of covered up top, but then down here, they're just out and um, out in the sun, you know, getting their spotlight. And I personally don't mind this at all. I also like that it's still nice and high-waisted here in the back. So sometimes these things step a little bit lower. I don't like that, and it doesn't happen with the Santorini bikini bottoms. Um, yeah, I think they're very flattering. I think they're very cute, very unique. Um, and they also will definitely stay in place, so I have no worries about these. So yeah, I think it's very cute. All right, I'm just showing you a different option to tie the bikini top in this lavender bossy print. Different option. Um, I still think I get a little bit of cleavage with this, so even with my small chest, but this is also definitely a style that could work for the bigger chested girls. And yeah, like depending on how you fold this over, you might get a little bit of this here where you can definitely see the solid color on the inside. And also of course in the back where you tie it, it's a little bit more obvious. So like I said, if you don't like that, if that annoys you, then just get a solid color of this one. But I personally don't think it's that bad or anything. Um, they should have just done it like last year though, with like the print on the inside for sure. Um, yeah, otherwise bikini bottoms are the exact same and the top is also the exact same. It's just like the way I tied it now that makes it look a little different, but you can do all the styles with, of course, the same Santorini bikini top um, and it doesn't really matter which color you get. Yeah.
All right, next up I have a one piece. Uh, this is from Popville. I've also recently reviewed them and they did send me some stuff, but I really, really like this one. This is the um, one shoulder cutout black one piece swimsuit. And I usually like colors, but this one just like, I don't know, I just really, really like it. It's a little more affordable maybe than some of the Buff Bunny pieces, especially because it's, you know, a one piece, so <laughs> you only have to get one item. Um, I got this in a size medium, I believe, and it has removable cup pads here in the in the upper body part here. And why I like this so much is because of the fabric. It's like a ripped fabric. I hope you can see that. And it's super stretchy and it's also super soft. So it's really comfortable. I think it looks very cute with that, like, you know, open part here. And um, it's just very comfortable to wear, really. Uh, it has one strap only because it's a one shoulder piece but the strap is thick enough and it's kind of like still holding up quite nicely i would probably not wear it for like a super like if you're doing like a very like a water sport activity like a super intense one maybe this wouldn't be my top pick but for sure for like just normal swimming or something this should hold up nicely and um, it is double lined so we have like um a normal fabric on the inside here that's also very nice and soft we do have some seams on the edges of the like the the holes <laughs> um but i i never found them like to be like too annoying or anything and i just really like the style of it but like i said the fabric is also really a, a plus point for this one because it is so soft and so stretchy it's also a little bit shiny but it's not super obvious i think but yeah the fabric for sure sells this and it's so nice it's like i don't know it's very comfortable it's cute um, it has the removal cup pads that I want and um, yeah it has it probably does have a little bit more coverage than the buff bunny pieces we looked at so far so also if you're more of a more modest person you don't like to show off your butt cheeks that much um, this could be a nice option for you as well or like just if you like sometimes like a little bit more coverage of course you know and it's still very nice and high-waisted in the bottom part so you're not gonna like expose too much of your lower tummy area again um, I will say this probably doesn't have too much compression in that area either but like it's black it's also very slimming right <laughs> and um like i said i just like the style of it and the fabric itself um so yeah let's see this one on all right here we have that little black number um i really really like this one and i'm just saying uh i should say that i have problems usually with like having a longer torso in one pieces because this is not a particular um, torso length so they don't have like regular and long like some other brands do but I think because of the cutout it still works nicely because this way just be aware of the fact that maybe if you have a shorter torso maybe you're gonna have a li like a little less of a cutout than I do uh, but I think like this cutout is basically genius because it makes it a little bit more um, versatile depending on like it, it doesn't really matter what what your torso length is because it's kind of like just going to like kind of fit your body of course you might have a little bit more like um pull on like that one side but it's not really like the same as having you know pull all over the swimsuit if if that makes sense i mean if you felt this before you know exactly what i mean with like the whole like everything just like kind of like pulling um and yeah i don't really feel it that much especially also i think what they did right was that the strap is on this side and not on the side where it's connected so it really is a short and long torso person friendly because it's kind of, but it's just going to fit everyone a little differently. So maybe we should um, just take that away from that. But yeah, otherwise like super comfortable. It's not like, I would prefer it a little bit more high legged, but like it's fine. It's not so bad. Um, I just find it a little bit more flattering if it's a little bit more higher. But like this way, I still like it. It's cheeky, um, but it's also cute. Uh, you don't see my belly button because it's nice and high-waisted here, so it's down there hiding away I still have a little bit more space here, so I'm not getting a ton of compression But that's also fine because I'm still covered and that's what matters and we do have removal cup pads here I don't think they're like super noticeable or anything. I appreciate that they're there Decent amount of coverage here in the front the thick strap that really is supportive So I don't mind not having a strap here on this side like sure it would have given me a little bit more support, but I'm not feeling like this is gonna like expose my boob, you know? Um, it's all good there. And then on the side, from the side, it really looks like you're just wearing a black bikini. From the other side, of course, it looks like you're full wearing a full-on swimsuit. So 
like that, <laughs> how it's different. And then the back, on me it's kind of cheeky. Um, also be aware that my butt usually eats anything, so <laughs> it's just like, eats anything, it eats everything, whatever. I can't talk anymore, but like it basically eats whatever comes its way, kind of. Um, so yeah, on me it's might, it might be a little bit more cheeky than on some other people, just be aware of that. And there is a seam on the side here, um, I don't find it to be very annoying or uncomfortable. And then in the back it's a little less cut out than in the front, which is also nice because you still get the coverage here in the back, you get a little bit of, of a peekaboo situation still. And then you just have that like one shoulder moment, right, that you also have in the back of course, which is still nice and cute. Um, I guess not the greatest for tanning because you kind of have to like get, take off that one strap as well maybe. So it's cute um, for tanning, you don't get like an uneven tan. But otherwise I think like this is such a great design for like everyone, you know, because of the torso situation, it's gonna fit. And I will also say that usually I'm a small up top and then a medium here, but it still fits me nicely here. Sure, I could have fit a little bit bigger boobs in there or like there's definitely a little bit more space, but I'm not feeling like it's gonna fall down or I'm gonna fall out or anything. Um, so I really like that. And yeah, I just like I just like the design and the fabric is so soft and cozy and comfortable. So I have no complaints here and I really like this one piece. All right, let's move on to the next set. Um, this one's a little bit more complicated because <laughs> I really, really like the bottoms and you compare them with so many, so many tops. So these are the shark bite bottoms also from Buff Bunny. And this one I actually had from last year, so the print on the inside is also there. Whereas this year, this is a print I have from this year, on the inside you have the solid color. So just uh, so you know, in case you get the, the bossy print uh, from this year, don't be disappointed if there's a solid color on the inside. It's just what I'm trying to say. You can also see um, it's two different years because on this one we still have that um, longer like bar with the Buff Bunny logo on there in the back or the front because it's reversible. And whereas uh, from this year we do have the coin and it's more off to the side. Um, why they put it off to the side is because they've made this one out to be reversible. And then of course if you have the oops, <laughs> if you have the logo um, like right in the front, that kind of looks a little weird. I personally prefer to wear it this way anyway. And the big, I mean, the biggest difference is that you have, here you have like the straight across seam here. And then in the back you do have, you know, like a shark took a bite out of it. You have a little V there. So I know some people like to wear it this way around. My preferred way is just this way. Um, these are like nice and high waisted in the front. And then there are cheeky in the back, uh, which I do like because my butt cheeks usually eat up the bottoms anyway. So if there's nothing to eat up, that's just easier, okay? <laughs> then we just start off that way. And I still get like the nice compression in the tummy area. I get a little bit of coverage there and I really like that. Same goes for this year, so the fit was the exact same. It's just the difference with the solid color on the inside for the prints now. So yeah, and why this is a little more complicated, <laughs> so we have these these two, these bottoms here, the shark bite bottoms, and you compare them with any top, it's, look, it's gonna look cute. So. One of my favorites um, that I also still have from last year, but they also relaunched this year, is the Surfside Bikini Top. So that one is um, just like a full coverage in the front. So this is a great one for water sports. And then in the back you have like, I'm just, so many straps, so much, so, so much length in the straps too. You have um, just like a nice open back here and you can kind of adjust that again to fit you perfectly and it's like nice and strappy and this one also has removable cup pads and I've also seen people pair this uh, just with like jeans as like a normal crop top or also as a sports bra. I mean you can do that, personally I prefer to wear it just for swimming. Um, but yeah this one is a great co coverage piece and um, just keeps you like held in and it pairs well with this one with the shark bread bottom because also they just they just fit and they're just on you. They're not gonna slide off or anything. But also I think these pieces you compare perfectly with the Sunkiss bikini top that we already saw. So you have the Sunkiss top <clears throat> and, dear Lord, <laughs> somewhere, hold on. Yes, yeah, so Sunkiss top here and then you have a little bit more of a more coverage bottom in case the Sunkiss bikini bottoms are not enough coverage for you. 
So that's also a great combination. I love this one too. And of course, if you like the bossy print bottoms and you don't want to do full on bossy print, this fits with any color. Like, you can just pair this with any color. You can pair it with like a pink and um, you'd be good to go. So yeah, I will show you the bossy print one on with the uh, Surfside bikini top and then we can do uh, this brown leopard one with the Sunkiss bikini bottoms. So you can see two different options how to style these bottoms. Because um, like I said, I think, like these are probably my favorite bikini bottoms of all time at this point. So let's see these on. All right, here we have my beloved shark bite bottoms. I just think they're perfect. They're really, really nice. Um, they're high-waisted, not as high-waisted as the Santorini bottoms, because you can still see my belly button. But, you know, you still have a really good amount of coverage here. Um, nice coverage also here. They're nice and high still, even though they're a little bit wider. So, you know, but it's like, it's still flattering on the hips. And then of course you have your high leg situation here. And then in the back, they're definitely cheeky. So if you're not a fan of cheeky, maybe these are not yours, um, but I do like them. And then you can also see that there's a shark bite that kind of also straightens out a little bit. Uh, so, you know, if you wear it to the front, you can kind of get a little bit of a V. Uh, I've definitely done that in some previous Buff Bunny videos. So if you're curious how that looks, just check those out. Um, but yeah, my preferred way is still this. Uh, I find with the V in the front, you kind of get like a little bit of like, you know, the pooch kind of like cutting in there. The pooch, uh, the, the lower tummy area. And this way, like, you know, it just, it just makes me feel a little bit more confident. And I really, really, really like it. And um, I just think it's very cute. And like this set, for example, is perfect for like any water activities you're doing. Because you're tucked in. You're like, nothing's going anywhere. You're secure, you're safe, you look cute, all's good. So um, yeah, let's talk about the top. <laughs> so this is the Surfside bikini top. Again, you have a very long string like we had with the Sunkissed bikini top. So you can kind of like, you know, tie it here, bring it to the front and bring it back. Again, I'm just too lazy to tie it behind my back, basically. It would be long enough for that for sure. We don't really have a band underneath here, but like it's still like kind of, I'm nicely tucked in here. Nothing is going anywhere. Great amount of coverage, nice and high here as well. So really nothing is happening. You can do your water activities without any fear of like falling out. Good coverage on the side too. And then the back, it's just like so nicely adjustable. Um, so if you have a smaller chest, but you have a wider back, you can still go for that smaller size because you can, you know, just open it up a little bit more. If you have a bigger chest, but a small band size, again, like you can go for whatever size you want because you can more tighten, tighten it a little bit more. You can loosen it a little bit more. So it's really good. And um, it's really cute in the back as well. So I like how adjustable it is. I like, you know, how it looks. And yeah, I'm definitely tucked in. Nothing's going anywhere. All is good. And um, now I will show you the brown leopard shark by bottoms with the Sunkiss bikini top because I think that's also a great combination. Those two pieces and yeah. All right, here we have the combination with the shark bite bottoms and the Sunkiss bikini top. I think it's super cute. You have a little bit less coverage up top and you have like a little bit more coverage down here. Um, I think it's super flattering. Again, same uh, Sunkiss bikini top we've seen before, but now with a pattern, but everything else is the same. Now I tied it in the back and I tried my best to not have it too long, but you can definitely see there's a little bit extra length for sure. And um, we still have this cute detailing here with the knots in the back. And yeah, so these are the um, track by bottoms from this year, but they still fit the exact same. Um, still like kind of barely cover my belly button, but not really. Um, same coverage here in the front, high leg situation and then cheeky in the back. So same here, but then you can see like if it rolls a little bit, you can definitely see the color on the inside, the solid color, which you couldn't see from, with the last year's uh, shark bite bottoms because print was on both sides. So yeah, that's a little like, hmm. but otherwise I'm super happy with this. I'm very happy with this combination. I'm also usually not like um, a print person or like an animal print person. I am a print person, but not, yeah, not animal print. But I did like this one a lot because I do like the color and I think it's very flattering as well. So yeah, but just showing you this combination also works and you can pair the shark by bottoms with anything basically. All right, I have one last outfit for you. It's a one piece. 
This is from Tulke, um, and this is the Artemis Midi one piece in the Ambrosia print. So this one is kind of like pretty sold out in most sizes, um, but there's a lot of different color options in print still. Um, available, they currently maybe still have a 70% off sale going on because um, I think they're going out of business. So if you can, if this is available in your size, you should definitely grab this piece. Um, and what I really liked about this one is they had this in regular length and in long length because I usually have a problem with having apparently a longer torso. So if I wear one pieces or like rompers or something, usually there's a lot of pressure on areas where I don't want the pressure on and they just don't fit lengthwise. So I got this one actually in a size long and I got this actually also in a size small. Usually my uh, bottoms are medium, um, but these ones are quite high cut and my chest is quite small. So in order to not like have too much space up here, I got this one in a small. And I will say this fits perfectly. So yeah, uh, the long length was also a great option to have and we do have removable cup pads in this one. You even have like kind of a built-in shelf bra situation here. And yeah, you can definitely take out the hot pads if you don't like them. Uh, it is double lined. Uh, I've also previously tested lighter to look at fabrics and they're not see-through uh, when wet. So you can check out uh, my to look at videos for that in case you're interested. I think in the first one I did a wet test on like a very light color a very light print and nothing was visible so you know it was all good we have nice thick straps and actually this one also comes so this is the midi right the artemis midi one piece it also comes with a little more coverage uh, as the artemis maxi one piece so i feel like you like this cut because it's a very simple one so it's a very pretty one but it's too cheeky for you then you can also get the maxi one piece uh, we have a very deep V here in the front and in the back we have like a neck, like a kind of low like scoop back situation here and also like I said high cut for sure and there it also comes with a belt so you can kind of just like you know tie that around your waist accentuate your waist a little bit and it's super cute and I really like it I'm happy also I got this actually in a small not a medium because I've recently tried uh, to look at one piece in a medium it was actually a little it was actually quite big in the in the chest area so I'll probably get that um like I'll get that to a seamstress and adjust it to fit me because I still think thought that one piece was also cute but this one just fits perfectly and um I like a very high cut on my legs because um when we talked about the sunkiss bikini bottoms it just it's the same thing it just looks very flattering on like if you have bigger hips but a smaller waist and it really accentuates your body and it just makes me feel confident you know um, but yeah, enough talking about this piece, let's see it on. Alright, here we have the last one piece, the Toluca one piece. And like I said, I think this long torso um, choice was a good one. <laughs> so I think it fits really nicely and you can see how nicely high cut this is here as well. So kind of really coming up nearly to your waist. Um, and I really, really like that. I think it's so flattering. The belt you don't have to wear, so you can also take it take it off, not wear it. I think it's a cute addition though. And it looks very cute. And it's, you know, I mean, there's no belt loops or anything. So it wouldn't like, no one would notice if you wear it or not. So if you're not a fan of it, just leave it basically. But I think it's, yeah, I think it's cute. We have a very deep V here. And since I took the small, I really don't have uh, too much spa extra space here. And uh, I still think you could like fit a little bit bigger boobs still, but like, I'm at least, I have no gaping here, so that's nice. You have the thick straps here to kind of give you a nice support as well. Um, a good, decent amount of coverage here, for sure. A little bit more like the first Buff Bunny bottoms that we saw, the sun-kissed bikini bottoms, and not as much coverage as some of the other bottoms we saw. So just be aware of that. And then of course, very, very, very high leg, as we could already tell from the front. And then in the back, you have like a very cheeky bottom here. Um, nice low cut here in the back as well so you can get a little bit of a tan on there too and yeah I think it's just like very flattering there's definitely like a little bit of extra fabric still here but like my my butt is just gonna eat it anyway so you know so it's, it's very cheeky but it's also very flattering for like you know the hips and the waist for giving you those curves and um, I just feel very confident in it like if I wear this now like I'm just I'm just good, okay? 
Um, I also like that it has removable cup pads. Not everything from Tuluka does have removable cup pads, but this does, which is very, very helpful in avoiding that nippage, you know. And um, yeah, I think it's very cute. And also the fabric feels like super nice and soft. And it's not too thick, but it's also not too thin. And like I mentioned before, I think it is also double lined. So don't you worry about this being see-through or not. But yeah, I think it's cute. All right, guys, it's conclusion time. Um, let me know how you liked my top selection of my like swimwear. Um, if you like the pieces too. If you have any swimmer brands you want me to try out or like swimmer brands where you're like, oh, I love these pieces and I wear them all the time, um, then also let me know in the comments below because I'd love to always try out new brands, try out your suggestions if I can. And yeah, if you have any, of course, if also if you have any questions about the pieces, any suggestions, if you want any help with sizing or whatever, please let me know too, I'd like to help. Um, I'd like to kind of like just, you know, chat with you guys uh, and uh, hear your guys' opinions and like your favorite brands and whatever. So I'm always, always glad for like your feedback and your suggestions. Um, you can follow me here on Instagram. You can also DM me there, but I'm more likely to see your comments here on YouTube. So if I don't see your Instagram DM, don't be sad, please. It's just like, you know, sometimes there's a lot and it's hard to like just dig through there. So just leave a comment here and I'll, uh, I'll definitely see that. So yeah. Um, but yeah, let me know what your favorite suit or your favorite outfit was today. If you if you have a favorite, um, yeah, let me know which one you would get if you, also if you don't want to buy one, but like which one, you know, you just like the most and you can see yourself wearing the most. Um, like I said, if you have any, any suggestions for, for other brands and swimsuits and whatever, just let me know. And otherwise, thank you so much for watching this video. Give it your thumbs up. And also, if you haven't yet, subscribe to my channel so we can continue growing. Um, I'm very grat grateful for each and every one of you. And um, yeah, I will see you next time. Bye.